your girl Frenchie J, your girl next door. So that makes sure all my neighbors. Hi, neighbors. Oh my God, let me show y'all something. Okay, so I got this Centronella candle. If y'all know what a Centronella, I was gonna try to show you, but if y'all know what a Centronella candle is, it's a candle that um, keeps the flies and mosquitoes and stuff away. We just saw one fly past me. Anyway, I was trying to light it because it has three wicks and only one is lit right now. But look, do you know what this is? I brought myself holding the lighter like this, you know, holding it down and the flame flew back up. But when I'm mad, I'm not even mad that my nail is messed up. <laughs> I'm mad because this is the infamous smoking weed <laughs> symbol. This is the, no, this is not even the infamous smoking weed symbol. This is the infamous I'm trying to smoke a roach symbol. When you grab the tip of that damn blunt and you don't ask me how I know this okay but anyway this is the or either your thumb but yeah honey I'm so mad my mama my daughter everybody gonna think if they see this I've been puffing poof poof passing and I have not been poof poof passing okay I have not been poof poof passing so I gotta get this fixed immediately I kind of want to wait till I need a fill in which I kind of do already but not quite but honey this, I'm about to go Take this polish off and put on another coat or something to cover this mess up because my polish literally melted and <sighs> I'm mad about it. Oh, well, let me tell you guys about the new channel I'm starting. I'm starting a, a channel for the kids. They already have two videos. I just have to edit and upload. We're thinking of a name for the channel. So if you have any suggestion for Simone K or KDZ, leave it in the comment below because um they have two things they want to show you guys and they were so nervous but they were excited and I'm getting ready to start them up a channel so it's just gonna be a little fun kitty channel I'll link the videos from my channel to their page when I set everything up but I just want to let y'all know to look forward to those kinds of videos and thank you all for your responses and being so sweet to me in these past couple of videos I really eh, needed you all like I'm literally just start crazy right now because now my son is with his dad my his daddy picked him up from his mama house so now baby is gone for another, another two days we was supposed to go to a birthday party tomorrow but i guess it's okay because my sister got sick anyway so she can't go no more and she was the one invited and kaden was like the plus one if you could say that for a birthday party but yeah and this is the point of sale i was going to show you guys but it's synthetic it's cheap and it's matted after three days three times wearing it and it's it's not good it's not good and it's shed it's shedding so it's not even worth telling y'all about when i buy some quality here i'll be sure to show it with you like my braided wig that was quality but this is not quality so i'm not gonna even tell y'all to go buy this this ponytail i've been brushing it out every night i know i'm not supposed to brush stuff but anyway let me show you what my store craziness has had. so this is everything that has to go upstairs but this is my living room now excuse this truck being an eyesore but I dusted everything, Clorox dusted and Windex everything. Like, look at this house. Look at this freaking house. Look at this house. Not a thing out of place except for my water and my juice. And, <laughs> and look at this. Look at this. Look at your girl. Excuse my bag of chips, but look at your girl. Okay, I even dusted something, as I probably showed you guys. I'm a thing out of place. I'm so proud of myself. I'm so freaking not a dish in the sink, y'all. Jesus, I'm so proud of myself. I did the damn thing. I'm so excited. And even my bathroom is clean. It's whistle clean. So proud of myself. So proud of myself. Okay, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry, but um, yes, let me show you why I'm showing you so many things. Cadence, school list finally came, and I said that a million times, but for those of you who are wondering, Caden is in year round school, and so um, he only had, what, six weeks of summer? So I'm on the way to go to Walmart and Target soon to get everything that he needs, and while I'm at Target, I'm going to get myself a new planner, because July my plan. My 2015, 2016 planner ended, so I knew um, all the other planners, if you know, to start in July, which it, I guess it goes with the school year. But that's so weird to me. Why wouldn't a planner go from January to December, you know? Well, if it's a 16-month calendar, why wouldn't it go to January to, you know, whatever the 16th month is? Why do all planners usually start in July? I don't know, but I need a new planner 
for the year 2016-17. And yeah, that's what I do to keep things in check for me as a parent, even though I'm not working right now. I still keep my doctor's appointments and things organized, and I write stuff on the calendar and put reminders in my phone. Even though it's a calendar on your phone and tablet and stuff, there's nothing like just having a physical something you can write down, take notes in, and keep up with things as a parent who has a child in school, or as a student who's just in school, or as a person that has to work and has clients and stuff like that. Um, so I'm going to get on to Walmart and get majority of the things, and I'm going to go to Target to get my planner because they have the prettiest notebooks and planners that the law will allow. So that's what I'm going to do, and then I'm going to come home and contemplate what I'm gonna do with myself for tonight. Um, I haven't spoke to my husband really all week. Like the last time I made the video, the last time we spoke, I don't know what's going on with my husband's okay. I don't know why he, you know, ain't called his wife up and be like, hi baby, hey boo, or anything like that, but honey, I don't know what's going on with him. I'm not gonna sweat him, because sometimes you just need your space to think. You know, like we said, we was talking all weekend about our relationship and whether we should move forward or step back, and I mean, kind of honestly reflecting a step back, even though we're very much in love, so. I don't know. I'm not going to pressure anybody. I'm not going to make someone have time for you when they don't. I've always been a firm believer in where you are is where you want to be. You with your brother, that's where you want to be. If you with your wife, that's where you want to be. You know? So I'm not going to call you. Where you at? Where you been? What you doing? And when you out of Why you ain't texting me? When you I'm not like that. I just can't. I can't see myself being like that. Ain't nothing more on being like that. I just can't personally waste my time on somebody who don't have time for me. So, yes. I can't find a pencil box now. Where the heck is the pencil box? I had to go right in front of my face. <laughs> and all they have is red. It's his favorite color. <sighs> now construction paper. I forgot to record me in the store. I was so hell bent on what I was trying to get, but I completely forgot that I was supposed to have been vlogging. I have a real bad addiction problem. The frappuccinos and not at just Target. I mean, my chips open. I had a craving for some bugles, y'all. I didn't mean to get this huge bag. But that's all they had in the hot flavor. And then I went to go get in place for this phone. This phone is white, you guys. Clean. This back has never been exposed as well as the front screen because I always keep something on it. And this was killing me. It's clear. Clear as day. But not on the phone. I bought this little cheap case for five bucks. I'm sure I could have got it cheaper somewhere else. Oh my god. Jesus. Okay. This is pretty white. This is cute. Cute. It's a hard case too. I prefer rubber because hard cases crack, but yeah. This will do for now. Oh, and look, I painted over my little nail at Walmart. I like. Okay. Let's go home. happen to anybody else you go to like three or four stores and you still forget something you guys I completely forgot the <laughs> dishwasher soap yeah 
You want to know the worst thing about it? I don't. I'm. I, I have probably one more wash in my dishwasher soap, but I still have a lot of um dish detergent left. <laughs> I'm using the last of it on my makeup brushes. Yes, I'm. <laughs> I bought a whole new soap just to use for dishes, cause the rest of that's gonna go to makeup brushes. Cause my brushes are dirty. And I think between my hair not being, my hair wasn't washed. It's washing now, but between my hair not being washed and me not drinking enough water and using brushes that I haven't washed in a while, it's causing my face to, face to break out. So I'm on the way home now. That Dollar General hasn't always been there, but it's so convenient now that it's there because it's right up the street from my house. But let me get off of this and drive safely, so. I pray that's not my apartment. I pray, I pray, I pray that is not my apartment up there. Oh my goodness. Okay, it looks like it's a little bit closer than what I expected. Oh, well I pray for whoever it is that does need this ambulance. Fire truck, I mean, well, it's both. 